Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can factory reset your Mac operating system. So when and why you want to uh, do this. So for example, you want to get rid of your Mac operating system or you want to sell your Mac operating system or you are facing some software issues in your Mac operating system and you want to reset it. Or the last option is, let's say you want to change your admin name in that case also you can uh, uh, do this. So before we start with the factory reset, you need to uh, make sure that you have the backup of your Mac operating system. If you have any data on your Mac operating system, you can backup your Mac operating system simply by using an application called Time Machine. For that, you just need to click on your Apple icon and then click on System Preferences. And once it's open, you can uh, click on this option which says time machine. I have created a full video about this uh, topic about how you can uh, use time machine to backup your data into a hard drive. So make sure you have the backup of your data before resetting your Mac operating system. So once that's done, we need to sign out of some of the applications, for example, we need to sign out of the iTunes. So I'm going to just click on iTunes option and then click on account and then click on sign out, which is going to sign me out of uh, this iTunes uh, account. But once that's done, I'm going to just close this. Also, if you are uh, signed in uh, to the iMessages, then you can just uh, click on the iMessages and make sure that you are signed out of the iMessages also. Also, uh, you can sign out of the iCloud uh, also. So just search for iCloud and open the iCloud and make sure that you are also logged out of the iCloud account. So once you are signed out of your iCloud, iMessage and iTunes, then you are ready to reset your uh, computer. So once you have backup of your Mac operating system and you have signed out of the uh, essential applications, now it's the time to reset our Mac operating system. So now at this point, you can reset your Mac operating system in two different ways. So let's see what are these two different ways. So first of all, you need to turn off your Mac operating system and then you need to choose one of the following options to hold while your Mac operating system boots up. First option is you need to press Command plus R key. And in which cases we want to choose the first option? The first option you can choose when you want to keep your Mac operating system. So you're not selling it or you're not getting rid of your Mac operating system, then choose this option, which is Command plus R key. Now in case you want to get rid of your Mac operating system or you want to sell your Mac operating system, you need to choose the next option which is Command Option plus R key, okay? So you need to decide which option you need to choose. And once you have decided which option to go with, you can just restart your PC and then hold on one of the key combinations. So I'm going to just uh, restart my Mac operating system. So I'm going to press Command R key on my keyboard of my Mac operating system, which is going to start my Mac operating system in the recovery mode. So I will wait for that. And you can see it has uh, started in the recovery mode. Here you can see all these options. I'm going to choose disk utility because I want to remove everything from my hard disk. And just press continue here. And here you need to choose your hard disk. In my case, it's uh, Macintosh HD. And then make sure the format is APFS. And when you press erase button, it's going to erase everything from your Mac hard disk. That's, that means everything is removed and you can now reinstall your Mac operating system and you can give this Mac operating system to somebody else. Now, if you want to uh, have a backup of your Mac operating system, so as I suggested, you should take a backup in a hard drive using the time machine and you can restore your uh, uh, Mac operating system using time machine from this disk utility also. 
Now I'm going to click on uh, reinstall Mac OS. That means it's going to reinstall Mac OS from the start on this Mac operating system. So now at this point, you can give this uh, Mac operating system to uh, somebody else and he will be able to press the, these button next and agree button and when he press on agree button he can choose the uh, hard disk here and then he can uh, just choose to install uh, the mac os uh, which is compatible for your mac operating system at this point you can click on continue button and this is how you can uh, reset your mac operating system and then uh, you can uh, just reset it to the factory default.